All right, let's take a look at percent composition as it relates to group compounds known as hydrates. Hydrates are a group of compounds that contain water in their crystal, but they're not actually wet. They're still dry substances. The water is contained around the central formula unit. They're ionic. Things like calcium chloride, dihydrate, and the dihydrate, prefix di indicating two, indicates you've got two water molecules for every formula unit of calcium chloride. Now these are lightly attached, they can be easily driven off, when we drive them off by heat, we refer to the substance as anhydrous calcium chloride, and it will always have two water molecules for one formula unit. And just like any other chemical formula <coughs> that has a fundamental unit, we can calculate its empirical formula using its percent composition or its percent composition using its chemical formula. Let's take a look at its percent composition. Let's assemble its different elements, calcium and chlorine in the compound alone at 40.1 uh, grams per mole. And if I add to it the 2 times 35.5, I've got 71 grams per mole coming from the chlorine. So just that part of the compound has a mass of 0.11, 111 grams per mole. That's the molar mass of calcium chloride. Now let's look at the water in there. I've got two water molecules, so I've got, as far as the hydrogen goes, I've got four hydrogen, each at one, so I end up with four times one equals 4.0 is the contribution of hydrogen. I've got two oxygen, each at 16, for a total of 32. So I end up with 36 grams per mole out of this compound is contributed from the uh, water. So if I sum those together, I get 147 grams per mole would be the formula mass of that. As a hydrate. Now if I want to calculate its percent composition, I take 111 divided by 147 will give me the percent that I've got for the calcium chloride. And if I take 36 divided by 147, it's going to give me the percent water in the compound. So, 111. This is water, and that's the calcium chloride. No matter where you find this substance, if it's in its hydrated form, that's what you would find. 75.5% calcium chloride, and 24.5% water. Pause the tape here for a few minutes and see if you can't calculate the percent water in copper 2 sulfate pentahydrate. 